John 7, 5. Ude gar hoi adelphoi autu epistuon eis auton. Here, the author of the fourth gospel sort of steps out of the narrative and gives an explanatory comment. He does this with the imperfect tense, which is something we've seen before. The imperfect tense used to give some background or explanatory information. So let's pick up here. For his brothers, that is Jesus' brothers, his half-brothers, not even, for not even his brothers were believing in him. And we know that from other places in the Synoptic Gospels. We see that during Jesus' earthly ministry, his, his earthly half-brothers were very skeptical and non-believing. But then later on, we see in the book of Acts how one of them, James, became the head of the Jerusalem church. Now, let's look at this verb, epistuon. As we said already, it's imperfect for the author stepping aside from the narrative and giving some explanatory information. How do we know that's imperfect? Well, you know, you see the augment there in the beginning. There's no sigma, there's no theta. You see that ending, you say, I bet that's imperfect, and it is. I've written out here the paradigm for the imperfect. We often don't have the time to review this, but it's a short verse, and we have students of all different ability here, so let's remember. Notice in the imperfect active indicative paradigm, you have the augment all the way through, and then you have your stem, lu, 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 and then we see our endings there, on, s, n, and that's a movable nu. It may or may not be there. Almen, eta, on. So this would be translated. I was loosing, you were loosing, he was loosing, we were loosing, y'all were loosing, they were loosing. Notice how the first person singular and the third person plural have the same ending, so context will have to tell whether it's an I, a first person singular, or a they, a third person plural. In this context, notice we have a explicit they subject, brothers, and so this ending on is in fact the third person plural. His brothers, don't forget your negative, for not even, ude, for not even his brothers were believing in him.